man. Come on, mama. All the way. Push him to the sky. Push him to the sky. Go, girl. Go, girl. Come on, come on. You got it. Keep going. Go, go, go. Good job. And again, one more. I know. You're so tough. Go, Joy. Go, Joy. Come on, Joy. That's it, Joy. You got it. There you go. Come on, girl. But yeah, man, we still here. I thought Logan's birthday was gonna be on the 25th, but it looks like it's gonna be on the 26th. I thought I handed it to you. Never handed it to you. So yeah, what y'all doing out there though? Comment, comment down below, what y'all doing? You wanna say your last goodbyes? I mean, not your last goodbyes, but you wanna say goodbye? Comment down below, moms. Comment down below if like <laughs> you had a birth plan and then when that pain hit. No, actually I did really good because I was having contractions from 8 p.m. last night until um, all day. And they've been on my way here for about 25 minutes in the house and then it takes 20 minutes to get to the hospital. I was having... Who's your dad sent me? <laughs> I was having contractions one minute apart and they were lasting for over a minute. So I was like, I really trooped out and I came here at 11.30 this morning. My dad was like, you ready to go? He was like, sure you wanna go? I'm like, yeah, I wanna go. And um, I didn't ask for the, well, they didn't let me have the epidural until about 4.30. So comment down below if like you had a certain birth plan and it ended up changing. Like even if you planned on getting the epidural and then you got there too late and you had to do it naturally. But um, yeah, so. All right, y'all. Next time y'all see us, we'll probably be having our little baby. Can't wait. Anyway, love you guys. Thanks for keeping up with us. And thanks for being a part of the ENT fam as we add on a new addition. Once you got the one, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> what? Everything's gonna be okay, you know what I'm saying? So, what we're gonna do is when you feel that contraction, I'm gonna have you take a big deep breath in like you're about to go underwater, hold your breath, tuck your chin to your chest like you're doing a crunch, and grab behind your legs right here and pull them back towards you and push real hard like you're trying to have a real big poop. I'm gonna have to be on my bag. With the epidural how do you want to be we can push like on your side and stuff we usually start out on your back and see how you do and then from there and based on the angle how he's coming down and everything finagle yeah if you have like a certain position you want to push in Rondo will probably be fine with it okay. midwives are usually pretty easy going about it a little bit. Just one of y'all gonna hold a leg. Yeah, I'll show you how to hold it in just a second. You're gonna do awesome. You're great. The way that you're going to hold the leg is you're going to support the bottom of the foot and then just, I usually just rest it up against me because that's easiest for me. But yeah, just like that, I'm going to put you up against my hip. Okay. Because then I can actually still use my hands. Okay. okay. So I'm going to see how you push a couple of times and then we'll take out your foley. And then when we get close, we'll call Ron Dick here. Starting to get one. All right, big deep breath in. Grab behind your legs. Hold that breath and tuck your chin to your chest and push, 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 push. That's it. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Hold that breath. Okay, so another big deep breath in. Hold it and push. Good. That's it. All right, another big deep breath in and push. All right, so instead of blowing all that air out, act like you're about to go underwater. Hold it all in because the Pressure in your diaphragm helps push against okay. the baby. So hold that breath and push. Just good, 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 good. Okay, are 
still having the contraction. Mm -hmm. um, Let's hold off and wait for the next one. Good. That was good. You moved in. Come on, little Logan. <laughs> Come on, Logan. So you planning on doing skin to skin? Yeah. Dad, do you want to cut the cord? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. Am I getting one? Yeah. Oh, yes, You're yes. getting one. All right, take a deep breath in. Hold it. Tuck your chin to your chest and push, 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 push. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Good. I'll take a deep breath in. And again, tuck that chin to your chest and push, 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 push. Good. your chest. And push, 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 push. Do you have any guesses on if he was going to have hair or not? Oh, she said that he has a lot of hair. He has a lot of hair. <laughs> oh, he can feel it too. <laughs> he has a lot of hair. She's like, is it a girl or a boy? He's got hair. Good. Okay. Another deep breath in. Take these hands and grab behind your leg. Can you? Kind of pull them towards you as you push down. So big deep breath in, check your chin, and push, 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 push. Good. Good. Okay. And one more time. Big deep breath in. And push. Push, 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 push. Good, 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 good. It really sucked, <laughs> but it helped. That's what I always try to remind my patients when they start going up. I'm like, this sucks, but it's doing big uh, things. Okay. <laughs> yep, let's use it. All right, big deep breath in. And touch into your chest and push, 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 push. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Okay, let it all out. Big deep breath in. And push. what's going on is you have your pubic bone that kind of sits right here and baby's molding and rocking and trying to get underneath that pubic bone so every time you push he comes down about three and then comes back about one and then comes down about three so it's all just 
getting him underneath that pubic so bone. The and then once he gets under that pubic bone, it goes it, a lot faster. So all of your work is just trying to get him to get under that pubic bone. But you're doing great. You're doing exactly what you should be doing. That's it, Joy. That's it, Joy. Come on, keep the it joy. coming. Keep it coming. Keep it coming. This is such a joy. I know. Absolutely. So impressed. The process is going to be friendly. It's okay. And what's his head for on his face? He says he's going to listen to what I say. You know, I have a feeling he's going to slide right on out. But But if it says if it does come out and she tells you to stop, we may tell you to stop just while she suctions his mouth. Curl up, curl that chin up, curl up around him. There you go. Come Good on, job. keep him caught. Perfect, job. right there, right there, right That's there. That's beautiful. Yes. Oh. Right there. Go ahead, Papa Bear. Put your oh, hands on your baby. Oh. Oh. He had to work hard. Oh. 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 And that little head is totally fine, Mama. It will go It'll right go on right down. down. So beautiful. That's what they have to do to get out of there. So beautiful. <laughs> I know. Oh, yeah, can you see his little face there? <laughs> yes, that little cat will see it on your head. It will make me sad. <laughs> Look at that handsome boy. What are you doing, big stuff? I know. Oh, baby. I know. Well, we turned it down. I'm talking about that daggone mirror. 